Thanks, Corrine. Does the administration still have close contact with social media companies? And in specific, are there still communications about removing misinformation? Look, um, I'm going to be, I, I, I know there is a, a currently SCOTUS, well, I don't even know if it's happening right now, but there is this particular uh, Missouri case. I'm going to be super mindful, super careful, uh, and not to, um, and, and not to answer a question that is, uh, uh, you know, adjacent to what's happening uh, with this particular case. Um, uh, I don't have any conversations to speak to or to lay out uh, to you about uh, conversations with social media. Obviously, uh, the president tries to communicate with Americans and meet them where they are. You see this. You see us do that uh, pretty consistently. I just want to be super mindful as uh, there is an ongoing uh, case happening at this so time. Now, speaking about the particularities of the case more broadly, can you talk about the administration's concerns on the kind of misinformation that's on social I mean, media? We've been, we've been, we've been, been pretty consistent COVID. about the importance of uh, you know it is it is the responsibility of social media to make sure. Uh, that uh, that what is on their platform uh, is uh, uh, you know is not misinformation, not disinformation. We've been always very clear about that. Uh, I just don't have conversations to lay out or to speak to, but we've been pretty consistent uh, for at least the past couple of years on that. Um, 